Hey folks, Fat Guy Flies RC. Listen, about today is what, the 15th? There's three more days left in the Valentine's Day sale at uh, Hobby Zone. And I can't remember if I, if I can take $15 or $25 off the price of this, but there'll be a code in the description of this video. But uh, my code, if you use my code, it's either $5 or $10 more than the sale price. And uh, so, anyways, that's the Marlin, a great little plane. Let's take her up and have some fun with her. I have the uh, suspension off the FMS Futura 64 that you can buy at Hobby Zone also. All right. If you're looking for your first EDF that's going to be a true, ex true EDF experience, the Marlin is, is probably about the best. Now, the E-Flight Habu is good. However, the Habu will float and float and float like a trainer, whereas the Marlin will to me, in my opinion, teaches you more of the EDF discipline. I'm running a, okay. All right, I'm running an AR630 antennaless Spectrum Smart Receiver in her. You will have to provide your own receiver. She does not have to fly super fast. This is about half throttle right now. Very stable Time little EDF. Got a little bit of a cross breeze. Got another plane up, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna fly my pattern, not be going back and forth. But uh, just a good solid little Landing. EDF. Flaps are down. Just to show you how slow this little guy will fly. Flaps, Flaps are back up again. I'm gonna bring her back by us close, close physically to us, and I'm gonna hit the gas as we come by. All right, I'm gonna hit the gas, three, two, one. I'm going to take her straight up now. One, two, three. Got her? All right. Time remaining. I got to give my, my camera lady a little better uh, warning. All right. Coming right at us now. In my videos, if you see little skips and jumps in us, whatever we... Um, that's where I edit out the parts where I don't give my camera lady enough warning and she loses the plane. So then I will edit that part out. I mean, because you can't see it anyways. I just don't want you all to think I'm editing out any mistakes. I specifically want to show you mistakes. Because you'll learn more from a mistake than you will on anything successful. All right, let's take her back around. We're gonna land her this time and we'll check the battery. Just a nice little stable EDF. Great beginner plane, great beginner jet, not a beginner plane. Flaps are in. We got enough to take off one more time. time one minute. All right. I'm going to come back down here. All right, we're going to take off one more time, do one more landing. You take off flaps. Take off flaps. And here we go. Circle around. Landing flaps. All right. I get lined up my runway. Get my wings level. There you go. Proof that she can do grass, no problem. All righty, 
one of our wonderful Mr. Martin came out yesterday and gave the grass a nice trim for us. Flaps up. All right, let me get off the field in case Mr. Tim wants to land and uh, show you my battery placement. Now that is a 2700 Liperior 4S, pretty much about a half an inch from the uh, front foam deck. Let me check the uh, battery and we'll talk about how much is left over. Now I flew for three minutes and 10 seconds. And I still got 48% left, so you can't beat that with a stick. If you put a 2700 in there where I showed you, a little bit of mixed flying, and you can get about four minutes and 20 seconds out of there, come back at you know 10 to 20%, preferably 20%. So really just that for 20, four minutes would probably be best. All right, folks, well that's the e, or the e flight. That is the Aeros RC Marlin. Great little beginner EDF, if it's your, not your first plane, but your first EDF for sure. Y'all have a good, and don't forget to like and subscribe. God bless y'all, and don't forget, faith, family, and friends, and then Jets. Bye-bye.